Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Sobo's Magic Lab. My name is Alexander. I am the Chief Evangelist of Sobo. A lot of you may not know me. So now, let me introduce myself. So, as a Chief Evangelist, I am in charge of digital marketing, including the YouTube marketing. And you guys can just call me Crazy Marketing Nuts. Yes! Crazy marketing nuts. This nut is not peanut, it's not walnut, it's not walnut, it's not chestnut, but it is just one kind of nut. Crazy marketing nuts. You guys may feel curious why I tell people around me that I can be called as crazy marketing nuts. Well, because I got huge passion on marketing and I always do marketing in a very strange way. Cool. So today we are going to introduce the Sobos upgrading student kit. Yes, the student kit include the tea time uh, student. Yeah. So I guess a lot of you can't wait to see what are the benefits you can receive from this new upgraded student kit cool so what exactly are the benefits you can receive from this new student kit well first with the new extended ptfeq it can make you less possible to under institution yes in other words it's make the printing result more reliable and we can say uh, closer to a perfect uh, printing result and also it can stand uh, extremely high temperatures yes with the new uh, student kit you can even stand uh, the temperature up to 260 degrees and what else well uh, with the new uh, PDF EQ and uh, upgraded in this uh, new student kit it's much easier for you, for you to uh, print with the soft mat uh, materials like the soft uh, filaments well, like the TPU yeah, why? because uh, the tube makes it much easier to fit the filament yeah, so that are the three main benefits you can receive from this new upgraded student kit well, so let us enjoy it! Oops. Now, let us have a look of different parts of this upgraded student kit. First, let us have a look of the bracket holder. Then, come with the step motto and the gear. And then, don't forget these cables connected to the main board. And here comes to a highlighting point. Yeah, have a look of this new upgraded for them. See the nozzle here, and another amazing thing is the bank here. And here comes to our hero. Yeah, let me show you what is that. PTFE2. Yes, see this new upgraded PTFE2. Is extended. Yes, with the longer PTFE tube, it's much easier to fit the filament. Yeah, and let's make printing of the soft filament like the TPU much more reliable. Yes, you can't beat this. And then let us have a look of the fan shield. Yeah, have a look. And I'm going to turn to this side. And finally, don't forget these three tiny screws. We already have a glance of different parts of this upgraded student kit. Now, let our partner install the student kit for all of you. Now, our partner is going to uninstall the old extruder kit first it's going to unscrew the nuts
now we already disconnect the extruder kit with the extruder board. Now it's going to unscrew the, the nuts so that uh, we can open the lid and disconnect the cables with the main board. Then we just need to let all the cables get out through the hole. The hole at the bottom right of the, the main board. Now we are going to connect the extruder kit to the extruder board. First, we are going to screw those four nuts on the board. And guys, look at the fingers how my partner moved the screwdriver. Isn't it elegant? It's a very cool structure to install the machines in this way. Now our, our partner is going to fit the fork end in the, with the other part of the extruder kit. is going to use the extruder bracket holder to cover it and use the screws to hide it yes we need to apply those three tiny black screws Then he's going to connect the nozzle fan with the hot end. And finally, we cover it with the fan fuel. And don't forget to, to screw it and then make it tight. Now he has finished hiding all the screws and finally connect the cable with the fan. First, he's going to get all cables go through the hole. Yes. Take a little bit of effort to go through the hole. But now we make it. Yes, we need to connect. Five different cables to the main board. First, we are going to connect it to the fan, and the one is holding in my partner's hand with the yellow and the blue one. Now connect it to the control board fan. Then the one with the red and the black one. 
That cable is connected to the fan. And then the one he holds in his hand is going to connect it to E0 motor. And then we are going to connect this cable to thermistor motor. And finally, this two red one is going to connect to the hot end. I want to do a little bit of work. Before you cover the lid for the main board, you need to make sure the cables connect to the right position. Okay, now it's going to uh, tighten the screws. Now we finally got this well finished upgrading is to the kit. Look how amazing it is. And guys, thank you for watching our YouTube video. And again, thank you for our amazing partner. And if you want to learn more about SVO1 and other products, Please subscribe to our YouTube channel.